So the Cambridge Admissions interview is just one part of a, a whole application that we look at in detail. So the teacher's reference, the previous examination results, the admissions assessment. So it's important not to focus too much on the interview. That said, there are very definitely things that you can do to prepare and to get the best out of that opportunity. So the first and foremost thing is that we're looking for candidates to be really fluent in the material that they've looked at at school. So we, uh, on your application form, you will be asked to indicate what topics that you've covered so far at school. And the chances are that we will actually choose some of those topics to discuss in the interview. It's therefore really important that you revise those topics and you know the fundamentals of those ideas. It's absolutely typical that we would include uh, some mathematics, some physics in a chemistry interview, chemistry and, uh, and maths, and then in biology, we'll also do some maths as well as some biology. So it's important that you really have revised the topics that you've, you've done. The other thing to say is what we're going to want you to do is to apply those ideas that you've learned at school to more problem solving, multi-step questions. And there are lots of resources available now for you to practice this. And the thing is that practice really does make a difference. And so going to websites like Isaac Physics, going to previous examples of the admissions test. The admissions test is in two parts. Some of it is multiple choice. Some of it may be longer step questions that you need to do. Practice really, really does help. Um, and the one thing that you will find in those tests is that time is short and therefore being fluent and having revised will really help with those as well. During the interview, we will explain how the process is going to work and what we're going to talk about. The most important thing during the interview, though, is that you keep talking to us. We want you to tell us what you're thinking. We want uh, we will explore your understanding of the ideas and may ask you why you think something is true quite often. And so getting practice at actually being able to talk to people that you're not too familiar with is really, really good as well. The one bit of advice that I can offer is that it's quite important not to worry too much about the interview and you're going to be nervous, that's understandable, but try to relax as much as possible. We're trying to simulate the supervision system here in Cambridge and therefore having a conversation about interesting questions that you absolutely won't know the answer to, um, but you're able to think about and discuss with the people that are interviewing you. Um, that's what we're aiming for. So getting practice and feeling confident in the material that you've learnt will mean that you can relax in that environment and do the best that you can.